Well, hey folks, Species7 here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Gold Rush, the game. You know, just in case you thought this was, you know, Gold Rush, the TV series or something, but... Just shutting down for the day, I had a reasonably prosperous day. I managed to collect some 460 grams of gold. So, with that said, I'm just about to... Uh, oh, the reason I have so much money is I took out a bank loan, unfortunately, a day early. I thought uh, two things. One, I thought the bank was going to be a little more generous in their amounts, but no, the most you can take out is 25 k And I actually took out 20000 and second mistake was I thought the small excavator said 18000 it said 28000 So even with the loan, it wasn't enough. So I'm going to go to sleep here, and I'm going to uh, end up having to give the bank $450, I believe, for the privilege of taking the loan out a day early. And then, of course, whatever our landlord decides to scoop out of my gold bucket. I want to have at least 10 ounces left here come morning. So let's see how this goes. Dawn. All right. There we go. Look at that. 135 grams of gold. I made 450. He took 135. Unreal. Unreal. The amount he takes. I'll tell you. You know, but they put purchasing the plot just too far out of graph. $60,000? I mean, to get to where I am, look at the size of the freaking hole I've dug. With a shovel, you know? <laughs> so, I mean, 60000 to buy this place? You'd never make it. I have purchased our wash plant with the gold from our first, well four days five days worth so there you are we do at least have that but of course what we really need is the uh, the means to fill it the rest of the stuff is fairly trivial fairly i mean obviously you know it's still something that needs to be thought but compared to the uh, the tool to fill it which is $28,000, the rest of it is trivial. Because we're going to want, uh, I think, a second generator, a second pump. Um, actually, no. We'll need at least a second water pump and probably some connect indicators between the two, i.e. hoses, etc. Um, perhaps if they have one of those piggyback units like they have for the electrical where you can, you know, string things out. Uh, I know it's slipping on this hill. I don't feel like putting it into uh, all-wheel drive or diff lock or whatever it's got. Um, so, yeah, we will need those accoutrements. I think we'll also need to get one of those magnetite separators from what I understand. Now, I don't know that you actually need to. I think you can simply wavetable your gold. But, uh, yeah, I think you do. Most, like, I, I've watched a couple of videos just to make sure I wouldn't, you know, have to make 12 trips to town because of not having a clue of what I needed. Um, and they both did purchase the magnetite separator. But from what I know, to then take the magnetite and sell it at the factory, you need that trailer. And I think that was... Uh, not a cheap little piece of spit by any means. But first things first, let's head off to the uh, blacksmithies. And uh, see what our money actually nets us, shall we? Ba 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 ba, Mr. Smith, are you home? Do 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 do. Mm, Six thirty in the morning. The blacksmith's a working. Good for him. Alrighty. 
Rock a chock a noodle. Three hundred and twenty five point seven four. Yeah. It's gonna cost us hundred and fifteen bucks and we're gonna lose an ounce. That's ridiculous. We're gonna lose a full ounce of gold. And what if you just sell the ore? Hmm. See, I don't know. It doesn't... Well... See, I don't want to click that and then have it sell it at a loss. I'd like to have it click that and tell me there's a certain amount. Like how much they're going to give me. Oh, I see. Gold ore selling. So 11,105. Oh, ore sale is minus 20%. Um, 325. All right, so it is actually less for... Uh, you are actually losing less here. Okay. That's all I wanted to know. I'm glad it does actually show you. Let's do that. Thank you. There's our gold bar. And off to the bank and we go. Yeah, it's in there. <laughs> it's not something you want to lose, man. Just just not, you know. <laughs> okay. Well, off to the bank we go. Yeah, I find both the... Uh, the bank and the landlord in this game to be just very very you know the rate on the loan is not a rate on a loan it's a rate on loan sharking like seriously i, I don't know that by law you'd be allowed to charge what these people charge you know and in a place like this i think if a landlord was that greedy he'd probably find himself lost in the woods one day know what i mean yeah but beyond that i guess it is what it is and we'll do what we can do yeah let's uh let's sell us some gold twelve thousand six thirty two so i mean it wasn't much but we made an extra grand going this way so yeah 35. All right. We do now have enough to get our little enterprise underway. It's, uh, how can I be stuck there? Again, not all it seems either. Because we not only, oh, did the engine not start? There we go. Guess not. Not only do we have to buy the excavator, but the uh, excavator doesn't appear free to our site. Now, I think you could probably drive it there. I'm not sure. Oops. <laughs> yeah. Always remember the parking brake, man. Always remember the parking brake. All right, here we are. So, now, my first thought, I'll be honest with you guys, I was going to buy this thing. And then I looked at the price, of course, 112000 Just because I'd be more comfortable running this. You know, I've used these in farm sim a bunch, etc., etc. These I always find to be a pain in the butt. There's going to be some complicated key thing on them, and, you know, yeah. Yeah, it doesn't leave us a lot. All right. Let's buy... Oh, quantity. Yeah, I'll take, I don't know, six. All right. There we go. Now, just like the uh, the store of tools... We have to actually uh, buy it. All right. We now own one. We only have...
Okay. So basically what they're telling you is you can't drive it off the lot. It's at some storage facility. You actually need to go here and have it transported to the uh, old Arnold parcel from their storage space, the small excavator. Yeah. We want you to here. Why won't you? Why? I can't change anything else. Why won't you let me transport it? To oh, really? I have to do that? Oh, I see. Zero of one, so small excavator. It still won't let me do anything. Why? Small excavator, storage space. Yes, please. Oh, here we are. Yeah, see, another $1,500. <laughs> Fine. All right, we're down to 4000 bucks after all of that. Wow. A $20,000 loan, 38 in cash total. And we've only got 4000 left. Jesus. But I imagine in a place like this, you know, we used to notice it years ago here in this small town because everything costs more money to get here you know it has to come in by boat we don't have a road that goes here so it's something you sort of sucked up into the cost of things and you know put up with it as being one of the wonders of living here but i don't think there was ever that much advantage taken care of and let's face it that's what this is you know what i mean the uh, the amounts being charged at the banks, the you know the landlords charging you know a tenth of all the gold you make and all of this sort of thing. That's simply because yeah, this is the sort of thing where they know regulators aren't going to come down and pile onto their head about it. I'm pretty sure, you know. So you sort of get away with what you can get away with. So four thousand dollars left is not much. All right, <clears throat> man. It is. Oh. No, I don't see anything there that I'm going to require or there. So that magnetite trailer, 5,000. All right, yeah, we can't even afford that thing. So the separator is a thousand bucks, and we are going to need another water pump. They're only two hundred dollars, luckily. Okay. Hmm. So these are the devices we have for water. This will double stack small hoses. This will double stack fat hoses. I think I'm going to buy myself one of these. Okay. And then we're going to buy us a couple of these. All right. I'm going to need at least one more small hose. Yeah, I'm thinking two. And I don't need that kind of splitter, but I might want to go for one of these. I don't know. We'll see. All right. We're going to need a power rope. Okay. I don't think I need those guys at the moment. I'm 
We're gonna need a water pump. Okay. So that thing also requires a small hose. Okay. Oh man, it's just so much stuff. And an electrical cable of what description? Ooh, a big one. There's a surprise. Um, hoses, cables, here we are. That power rope, thank you. We're probably just about at our limits. All right. Now I'm pretty sure I've got enough buckets back at the uh, camp. So, what is that going to run us? 1390. Let's do her. Wow. Um, all right. Let's go get some of this in the truck. There we go. Do, 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 do. Ooh, that is quite a mess of stuff. All right, let's start with this puppy. The separator to magnetite. Okay. Put you right there. Sure. I believe you're solidly affixed to the vehicle. <laughs> Not so much. Uh, I wonder if we're going to need some more fuel. Might be a thought, eh? Grab a couple of Jerry's. Alrighty. Double Who's It connector. Oof. No, that's not going to do it, actually. I don't want to end up... Because you can, although it's really good about holding stuff inside, it will allow stuff to squeeze out between the tailgate and the bed. Although usually right here, type of thing. Ugh. Oh, come on. <laughs> really? Come on. Out of my way. It's just a hose for God's sake. You know? Man. This stuff should not be so hard to stack in here. It's just a bunch of hoses. They should pretty much just lay flat on the ground. <laughs> Instead everything seems to have to hover an inch above anything else. Not sure is it oh. And of course you can't jump unless you're in exactly the right spot. They're ridiculous. <laughs> Believe me, I can fit more than uh, three or four hoses into the back of a pickup truck with a couple of pieces of very small equipment. You know? Oh well. They don't seem to want to really... Uh, can't close the sideboard. No, of course not. Why? Because that hose is in the way, right? Yeah. Now look at that. <laughs> I mean, it's ridiculous. Stuff's just floating three feet above everything else. 
Oh, God. You gonna fall into the truck? Yes? No? That's just ridiculous. Oh, well. I mean, put a cargo net over it or something. I mean, I could understand if this was something groundbreaking they were trying to do. But, I mean, the fact of it is, come on. How many games have very easily gone well past mastering that point in things? I'm just checking here to see if it's actually going to stay. Looks pretty good, you know. I think we'll be all right. So... I kind of feel like there might have been something else I'd want, but for now, we're going to call her and head back out to the plot. Oh man, look at that. That one hose is now on the roof. <laughs> Oh, boy, oh. What are you doing to me, truck? Really, it's only a matter of time before it flops off of there. <laughs> uh, I mean, my truck's not exactly uh, giving her on the old fuel supply either. That's something I may have to think about. I probably, yeah. I wouldn't have been able to put him in the truck, though. I'd picked up a couple more cans of diesel. Slow down a little. Oh, I knew it was going to happen eventually. <laughs> uh, I was going to say, slow down a little or this hose is going to fly off. Well, guess what? Yeah, that's just... Uh, I know, I know, I know. I'm allowed to touch the gas pedal before I release the handbrake. It's not like I jammed it to the floor. Alrighty, let's get up here. <laughs> you're like, God, you're so whiny. <laughs> yeah, I am. <laughs> I know. I just, it is one of those things, like I said, every time I see, oh, patch number, blah, 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 and then you read it, and you realize it's not a patch. You know, they've added a conveyor belt. They've added a thing for, you know, the $100 million wash plant when you're in Tier 9, and, yeah, when there's things like, really? You know, I can put four garden hoses into the bed of a truck before they're floating six feet off the ground because there's no room. Why does that just not make sense to me? <laughs> All right, I'm going to actually come down here a little bit. And, uh... Stop rolling. It's ridiculous. All right. So, small hoses. See, why don't they do that in the bed of the pickup? Is that a little room that takes up? Isn't that weird? It's just like it takes up the room of, oh, I don't know, two hoses? <laughs> and then we'll put this guy right beside him. Nice. That's all I want. Just for them to actually stack that way in the truck. And some fat hoses for water. Nice. <clears throat> oh. 
I think I might have got one extra of these. But that's okay. That's okay. Better to have an extra than have to drive all the way back into town for something as trivial as a garden hose. Because, I mean, that's just standard five beans garden hose, let's face it. Or maybe three quarter, I don't know. I suppose depending what part of the world you're from. I think this will be a useful device. I like the, uh, the one that splits it into four small hoses from one large one. That's very useful. All right, now it's time to get the big guys. One water pump, and it's likely going to end up up here anyway. So, I believe, yeah, that'll probably do. Let's just drop her there. And the magnetized separator. It's going to go over wherever we decide to set up our, uh, our wash plant. Which for now means it's going to go there. Alright, well, at least we got it all home, I think. And uh, hopefully, it's going to be pretty much everything we require. So, what I'm going to do here now... Wow! I just spin my tires all the way up the hill. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Now, I'd say we can drop this pretty much anywhere on what they call uh, the claim. So, with that in mind... Oops, poor job, buddy. Come on. Ugh. Perfect. Right there. Right there. Really, I'm not close enough? Because, yeah, this thing's so sensitive. See, there's how much good tapping the reverse does. There we are. You gotta lock the handbrake on as soon as you see that ball turn yellow, man. <laughs> Oh, this game needs some serious physics work, let me tell you. Some serious physics work. I mean, it's better than when they started, when you basically had things to, yes, explode out of the box of the truck if you uh, hit a bump wrong, or I don't know why. It actually never happened to me, but I read many, 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 many mucho, mucho reports on it, so. Okay. I would imagine that ideally, we'd probably want to be up on this nice space where we're going to have just a no end of dirt to dump into this puppy. How's that? Don't, don't go flying in reverse. Lord. Okay, so, now I guess if I'd have put it closer, we probably would have found a water supply a lot closer, eh? I wonder if maybe I shouldn't have it down there. Ah, well. Anyway, guys, I think that's all I'm going to do with it this time around, unless, of course, there's more water somewhere else that I just don't know about. Um, yeah, it doesn't look like it, eh? Huh. You think there'd be more than one creek around, but no, there's no water in there. There's nothing over there either. So, I think I'm gonna have to do that. We'll uh, probably end up hauling it down to uh, you know here, right here. So, but that'll be next time. Till then, though, I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you want to see more, let me know in the comments down below. Don't forget to smack that like button on your way out as well. So.
Yeah, I haven't touched a gas pedal. <laughs> oh, now all of a sudden it's going back forward again. Okay, come on. No. Ugh. Oh, come on. I think it's glowing yellow. Good lord. This thing just rolls all over the place. <laughs> you can't even stop it in one spot. Man. Oh, and now it's rolled out of position. All right, I'm going to end it there before I drive this truck up a tree or something, I tell you. There. That's close enough. All right, folks. Take care of each other and ciao for now.